Hey, what's up, guys? It's Cameron Bob here, and uh, I just downloaded the new Xbox 360 uh, dashboard tonight, and uh, I'm going to give you guys a little um, rundown of the changes and what's new and what's going on. Uh, first of all, when you log in, uh, this is the main screen. Uh, the left here you see uh, Modern Warfare 3. Click on that to play it. Uh, then, uh, you see here, as this, uh, game loads up, the Xbox guide button is, uh, everything here is still the same. You got, see, if you see at the upper right, you can see, I'm not sure what that is, it's like a, uh, frankly, I don't know, I don't know yet. <laughs> Try to find out as soon as I can. Uh, see, it's called Xbox Home now. It's uh, it's no longer called Xbox Dashboard. Uh, here you got your standard friends. Everything here is the same. It's all the same. You're all familiar with this. Recent players. Regular party. Everything here is the same. Same old. Messages are same. Uh, beacons and activity. This is new. Uh, click on this. Let's see. First thing that comes up is my activity. Uh, it shows the last five games you've played and the apps, along with who's been playing them. So, uh, let's go to my Warfare 3. Look at this. It shows you. shows you everybody who's played the game recently. That's pretty cool. That's a neat addition. Very cool. Uh, if you go over to this left, you could uh, set a beacon. That's why uh, when we uh, turned on my Modern Warfare 3, it said uh, USAF Airborne's online. is because he uh, set a beacon. So apparently you could tell then that you, you play the game, but I'm sure you could just figure it out in the friends activity anyway. Over here, you can see the different games and apps that you've been playing. Uh, right now, I got one friend online who's playing Modern Warfare 3, and 26 friends have recently played it. Uh, Black Ops, 11 friends. Here's Skyrim. I don't even have Skyrim, yet it tells me 10 players have, uh, 10 of my friends have played that, which is pretty cool. Okay, I think that covers beacons. Chat and I am standard. Uh, same old button. Over here, you got achievements. They did a little thing with the achievements now. Like, let's say... Okay, I go to Modern Warfare 3 achievements. And I go to this achievement. Uh, beating the campaign on Hardened or Veteran. Uh, if you press X to share the achievement, you could actually... Look at this. You could actually post this achievement on your Facebook account. Saying, look at me. I got this achievement. Can you do better? I mean, I think that's really cool. You could share that right on your Facebook wall. That's a pretty neat addition. Like, if you're proud of what you did, you could just post it right on social networking site. I thought that was neat. Uh, that's the only thing changed out of the achievements that I saw so far. Uh, let's see what else we got. Awards, that's stuff for your avatar. Again, that's the same. Uh... Quick play, that's where you go. That's the same to play your downloaded games or whatever. My games, it shows you your game line. Very. Uh, this is all the same. Uh, this is the same, and this is the same. So let's probably press Y and go back to the home. And any questions that you guys may have, uh, you haven't downloaded the new uh, home yet, Xbox Home. Send me a message or whatever, and I'll I'll help you out. Uh, this is this is almost like the marketplace here. Uh, there's a certain Arkham City. Uh, this box in the lower left here, quick play. Those will show game demos, stuff you've downloaded. Uh, this is an advertisement. But this is like you remember this from the marketplace. How it scrolled through in the old one. Uh, let's check out this cloud saves. I don't know what this is, so find out.
Okay, it's like an Xbox 101. See this? This is my memory unit with all my saves for the games I'm playing. Alright, that's cool. Uh, I guess you guys could just check that on your own. I just want to get through this stuff that you may have the difficulty into. You could just go that on your own and watch it. I, I want to get through this. You see on the uh, upper right, puts your friends, messages, and achieve in a gamer score all at the upper right for you. It doesn't really scroll. Uh, so if we press uh, LB here, we could search for a game. I, I don't know what this is. Search for something. I don't know what should we search for. Uh, let's see. Battlefield. Oh, you could go right down. What's this? I guess it just shows stuff you could download. Yeah, you could purchase the game online. That's neat. You could just type in anything you want, really. And see if they have it. Alright, let's... Oops, skip the social. Uh, social, if you go to the social tab. Uh, friends are right here. Uh, it shows you who's online. You know my friends. Who's online. Uh, parties. I don't have any parties. I'm not a... Again, these are the beacons and activities that I showed uh, before. Uh, you can just add a friend. Uh, social apps. It says. Oh, there, you're, there you go. You could access your uh, Facebook or your Twitter, or you could do video connect. I don't have a connect, and I'm not gonna log into Facebook. Uh, change profile, sign in or out. Click over here in your name. Uh, you could. This is where you customize your avatar. You can view achievements, change theme, what have you. There's your. You you can change your gamer tag right there. Uh, let's see what else. Just shows your information. Uh, video. Here's like the video marketplace, if you remember. Uh, inside Xbox, there's an advertisement. Who cares? You can watch ESPN basketball. Family Guy, Hulu Plus. Uh, go over to games. You could go to your game library, the demos and stuff. Uh, go to game marketplace, buy games, download games. Um, Chuck Norris. Stuff like that. Music. See, all this is similar, except it's uh, organized differently. Like here, you have to press the RB and LB to get to it, instead of scrolling up and down. Here's music. Uh, apps. I really want to check this out. Uh, let's see. My apps. Let's see what this is. Picture viewer. Oh, it's like the... Uh, okay. I don't have any videos or anything, so... What is this? Music? Ooh. What is this? It seems like it's downloading. I'll probably just cut this out of the video. Never mind. I, well, I'll. You could do that on your own if, if you want. I'm just trying to go through a quick uh, browse through. Here's your Netflix, movies and stuff. Here's your ESPN. Uh, settings. You got your system settings. Your account settings. Privacy settings. Here you could just turn off your Xbox right there. Which I'm not gonna do. Uh, look at it with your profile stuff. I don't really. Same old preferences. But uh, if you guys have any questions, any comments, uh, just leave them. I'll answer them as best I can. But really, it all seems uh like the old the old way out. Except uh, you just press LB and RB to navigate. That's all I've noticed so far. But I know earlier in the uh, the month of December, I know uh, I'm going over this. It's December fifth right now. But I think earlier in the month of December, uh, they're gonna release more updates with YouTube, uh, Hulu Plus. Well, there's Hulu Plus right there, but they're gonna expand on it. And uh, I'm really looking forward to YouTube. I'm tempted to see how that works and stuff. But um, I think that'll do it. 
I hope you guys enjoyed the this little tutorial I just threw up. Thought I'd get it out there for you. Hope you all enjoyed, and as always, catch you later.